FTMO challenge explained. FTMO challenge explained. Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, somebody uh, asked me after I posted a previous video on my opinion on FTMO challenge to actually go ahead and explain what, what is FTMO or the FTMO challenge. So this is just a video to explain it and try and make things uh, easier to understand uh, for the rest of the traders out there. By the way, if you are new on this channel, please consider subscribing so that you do not miss future videos. Uh, go ahead and like the video. Uh, as you already know, everything that I give out on this channel, my experiences, the information that I have, uh, answering your questions, everything that I do on this channel is for free. In, you can even see the links in the description box below. Uh, visit those links and see if you cannot find what you are looking for to use in your trading, whether it's forex robots, whether it's indicators, whether you need books and uh, stuff like that. So visit those links. You can download everything for free. Everything on this channel, guys, is for free. So go ahead and just like uh, the video. If you have questions, I enjoy reading your questions and trying to answer your questions. Uh, going, I go out of my way to try and answer the questions that you might have, things that you might be struggling with. So this is FTMO challenge explained. So first of all, uh, what is FTMO uh, and the challenge and uh, so this video will just give you a summary, an idea of what we are talking about. So basically what FTMO is, is a funding company. FTMO is a trader funding company. What do I mean? Basically, you probably are a good trader. You are probably a good trader. You have got uh, perhaps a forex trading strategy that works that is making you a lot of money but your challenge your challenge is a funding you can make more money if you had access to much more uh, capital it's uh, like a bank let's say you are making shoes and those shoes are selling like hotcakes but you see that uh, you are not making as many shoes as you should be but only if somebody can lend you some money in order that you can expand your operation and actually make more shoes so that you can actually make more money so that's basically what ftmo is it's a company that funds uh traders uh you have uh, uh successful trading strategy or perhaps you have a trading robot that makes you money if you are making a lot of money in trading but you feel that if only you had that much more money to start with you can actually make more profits if you do not have capital for trading this is it so basically this is what they do or they they provide capital and you receive up to 90 percent of the profits that you make with their money for example if they give you a uh, hundred thousand dollars to trade with it means you get to keep ninety thousand uh ninety thousand uh, or ninety percent of the profits whatever profits you make out of that hundred thousand you get to keep and what they also do is they cover the losses and losses that you might incur but it's not like they are just going to say come and let's uh, just give you money and you go on your way that's why they have the ftmo challenge that's the purpose of what the ftmo challenge so the process of actually getting money from ftmo is divided into three stages the first stage is definitely the ftmo challenge which we are explaining and the second uh, stage is a verification then the last stage is where you're actually an ftm or a trader so 
you first of all take a challenge where you need to prove your skills and uh, discipline in observing this uh, the objectives that they set for you once you succeed here then it shows that uh, you are somewhat trustworthy and you are probably what you who you say you are you you are a good trader then they still need after you pass the challenge then they still just need to verify uh, the results uh, whether this was not a fluke and they actually also need to verify you as a person they, that's why this stage is basically just to get to know you better then from there then you qualify for uh, FTMO uh, funding so you can see if you scroll down here basically the FTMO challenge it looks at how much money are you looking for how much money are you looking to be funded with are you looking for 10,000 are you looking for 25,000 are you looking for 50,000 US are you looking for a hundred thousand are you looking for 200,000 basically they are trying to what uh, to meet every category of trader out there so but you probably already have 10,000 in your account and you are killing it with the the 10,000 but you feel if you could get access to 100,000 then you could play in the big leagues but uh, no friend is willing to give you a hundred thousand so you can come here and actually do the challenge and see if you can uh, be uh, funded with a hundred thousand or the two hundred thousand so if you're a good trader you've got a good trading strategy you you are disciplined everything is uh tip top this is uh, a way to get uh, uh funded so you can see the conditions there here you actually have uh, the drop down buttons you can click on there it basically explains uh, uh everything it basically explains everything so let's say you are looking for ten thousand you want this company to give you ten thousand maybe you are trading with a two hundred dollar account you are killing it with the two hundred dollar account five hundred dollar account one thousand dollar account you are killing it with the account but you feel if only you could get ten access to ten thousand you would it would open doors in your trading so you can come here and click on there definitely uh, uh, to try and do the challenge you still first select the 10,000 there then for the challenge the first step you actually have 30 days to complete the challenge many people actually uh, complete uh, the challenge in uh, less than 30 days but you they will have uh, a minimum of days that you need uh, to to trade uh, uh, this so it's minimum is 10 days you actually need to trade for minimum 10 days uh let's say you are so good you don't need uh, 10 uh, 30 days to do the challenge but you must still show a track record in 10 days and this is so that uh you you is you are not like uh quicking results or maybe you are you are if they give you one day to make this amount anyone can do it you probably just do it because that was a good day to trade but the next day if you are going to trade the next day you probably lose it all so they give you minimum 10 days so that they can actually see your consistency because they have set targets here during these 10 days the minimum 10 days or if you're going to trade the whole 30 days the minimum daily loss because uh, they are going to give you uh, 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 some money to uh, to trade with the minimum daily loss that you because it's on demo uh, you need to understand that it's going to be uh, on demo so the minimum that you are going to lose should be five hundred dollars that's the minimum that you are supposed to lose again you can click on this tab and it will explain everything so the minimum that you are supposed to lose is five hundred dollars per day out every day of these ten days. Uh, so that the maximum 
loss not minimum loss the maximum loss is five hundred dollars per day so they allow you to uh, take some losses it's not like they're expecting you to be 100 percent profitable there's nothing like that in trading so but they are counting on you to have discipline even managing your risk managing your losses so the maximum daily loss that you can have is 500 dollars the maximum loss that you can have all together is 1000 so the moment you start losing uh, 500 today 500 tomorrow you basically you have lost the challenge because the maximum that um or maybe uh, those two days is fine but the next day or the remaining days of the of the challenge you cannot take any more losses because then you have reached your maximum loss which is 1000 so they will not allow you to lose more than uh, basically one thousand one ten percent 10% of the amount that you are applying for 10% of the amount that you are applying for and basically profit target is 1000 uh, they are looking that uh, you can actually demonstrate uh, you can grow the account by 10% then this is where it gets interesting in order to take this challenge you actually need to pay uh, 155 pounds that's depending on the amount that you want to be funded for the amount that you are looking for for example if you are looking for twenty-five thousand, you see the amount goes up 250 pounds if you are looking for 50 it goes up to 345 pounds if you are looking to be funded with a hundred thousand it goes to 540 pounds if you want to be funded with uh, two hundred thousand uh, dollars you need to uh, pay uh, one thousand and eighty pounds in order to take the challenge this is the money that you pay before you start the challenge um, as i mentioned in the previous uh, video this money uh, if you fail the challenge if you fail this challenge you basically forfeit this money that you have paid uh, to take the challenge but if you happen to pass the challenge then you go to the verification stage the verification stage you don't need to pay any more money is actually free it's actually free and when you become actually uh, uh, a funded uh, trader they actually because the 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 share the share scheme that they have is usually uh 30 70. so basically any profits that you make with the amount that they give you for funding basically you get to keep 70 percent of the profits and they take 30 percent of the profits but you can see they said up to 90 percent of uh your profits maybe things are changing so you can keep up to 90 percent of your profits and they take 10 percent of the profit then after giving you uh your 90 percent of the profits they will actually also give you the money that you paid to take the the challenge this is where what it means by a refund that is what it means by refund so if you fail the challenge you you forfeit this amount uh if you pass the challenge and this is for those looking for two hundred thousand dollars if you are looking for ten thousand dollars it's 155 pounds if you pass the uh, challenge yes still when you get to be uh, a funded trader then they can give you back the 155 pounds on top of the 70 or 90 percent uh of the profits that you are keeping so this just basically um explains the ftmo challenge uh people are asking why well, ftmo what is that was the ftmo challenge and stuff like that and that's basically uh about the ftmo challenge if you are a successful trader and you are making lots of money with your trading but you feel you need access to bigger capital because you are killing it with a small amount 
now you need uh, access to a bigger uh, uh, funded account or bigger account so that you can actually make more money. This is uh, what FTMO is about. If you still have any more questions about this, you can see the verification instead of now taking it in 30 days, they actually now allow you to take it in 60 days. So things kind of uh, now are lax. Uh, here there's pressure, but here things kind of uh, 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 slow down. You can see even the profit target, No, instead of 1,000, now you just need to make 500 so that they ver really verify that you are who you say you are. And so the, they kind of take off the pressure when it comes to step two verification. Once you pass this, you become a funded trader. They actually fund your, give you funds to trade with. So if you still have any more questions around uh, FTMO challenge, I've tried my best to explain it. and. You can actually, this is uh, a risk uh, normal. What it means is like normal trading. If you want to be an aggressive trader, you can see also the things will change. Uh, let's say you you, are, you want to use aggressive uh, tactics. So uh, things kind of uh, uh, change. Maximum daily loss instead of 500. It's now uh, a thousand because we understand that you are you are trading aggressively. Uh, maximum loss instead of a thousand, it's now uh, two thousand. If you are looking for ten thousand, the example that we are using, and profit target is now also two thousand because you are being aggressive. So just go to the F FTMO uh, website. They actually explain everything. The instead of uh, paying one fifty five pounds, it's now two hundred fifty pounds if you are looking for ten thousand dollars so that's basically uh what it's about uh go to the website and everything should be clear on there uh until next time bye